How's it going guys? Dan here from Who Figure Adventures and today is Doctor Who Dot and Bubble last week on Doctor Who 73 Yards. Um, if you watched my review last week um, I stated that I weren't the biggest fan. Um, I didn't really understand it uh, and I thought it might definitely need a rewatch which it gave it over the week. I gave it a couple. We watchers and it's definitely better than what I thought during the video and um, I still think the ending lets it down a bit but yeah with that being said though it was a good, good episode I just think the final 5 to 10 minutes let the episode down a bit but uh, Dot and Bubble today which apparently is a very Black Mirror-ish style episode uh, it's also supposed to be a bit Dr. Light unfortunately again uh, but does feature a good performance from Shooty so we'll have to see we'll have to see what it's like um, and yeah should be good um, I'm excited so without any further ado well the titles I have, a, I have a feeling this episode will look very good. Very visually pleasing episode. Which should be good. Oh my goodness. Oh look at this guy. You don't know me. Here he is. The doctor and your life is in danger, okay? There are creatures out there in the real world. There are monsters and they are coming to get you. No. No, Lindy, do <laughs> Okay, I thought like this might be a funny episode. <laughs> yeah, I'm expecting this episode to look very good. This is an uh, episode RCD has had in his mind for about 10 years or so, so... Hi there, Lindy. I'm just doing a system check on the time enterprises. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? That's great, and everyone does this the whole city. How stupid can you... We all work two hours a day, two long hours, and then we get the rest of the day free. Isn't it obvious? And you Sounds like really heaven to me. That is correct. <laughs> I don't know why they bothered really CGIing over it, because I remember the filming pictures, and it's not a bad model. It's okay, I'm here, but I've got a friend, he knows how to deal with it, I promise. Here he is. <laughs> Here he is. Oh, leave me alone, will you? This is just getting so ridiculous. I'd like to know what the bubble, down. bubble and dot, what dot, dot and bubble actually is. I could get the, this bubble is some kind of VR, AR kind of uh, thing. But what's the dot? It's like, what powers it? Forward. Forward. It is a cool design, Forward. that though. Forward. Turn left. We're doing really, really well. Oh, condescending much. Forward. Forward. Stop, Forward. stop, 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 no, run! run. There, there, there's a murder. There was a murder ten feet to my right. All lines are busy. We regret. We cannot help you at this time. Please, it's like a wedlock. That's why we're here, and we're gonna get you out, I promise. In fact, a lot of people have said that this episode is very much like the Macro Terror. So I don't know how true that's going to be, but um, I love the Macro Terror, so if it's anything like that, then I'll be happy. Sorry, sorry, but could you please? I'm a fan of this outfit. That's this reveal outfit, isn't it? Bubble down door. I just hope we get to see him in the jacket. Love Island, the planet. <laughs> Mummy paid for it all. We miss you so much, darling. There she is. But I pay for the whole moon to make you happy. Just look up at the sky and wave to us on the home world. <laughs> look at these two. Fine time. Yeah, she's like, she's the face of the amulets in Pastorium. Yeah. No, I've seen her somewhere else. Are you two in the same place? Hang on, how does Ruby remember no. 73 yards? Uh, sorry, we'll save that for later. 
You are. You're in the same room. You're together. Oh, what the hell? Yes. Mm -hmm. You... You lied <laughs> to me. This is like a conspiracy. Who well, never are didn't. you? You just We're never just asked. Oh, for land's sake, Lindy, don't be so silly. Not even I would say something like that. Just oh. There goes Gothic Paul. <laughs> Lindy Pepperbean. I will get you out of here. I promise. What's his deal? I feel like he's it's hiding something. It's the worst day of my life. But maybe it's the best. He's definitely hiding something. There's still thousands of people being eaten alive. Yeah, this way. It's like having a new Doctor and Companion, but bought off uh, Wish. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is so manual. Yeah, good thing is none of them have been eaten so far. Why? Well, That's good. Says, my friend, <laughs> it's all that matters. He says they're saving us to eat last. Pavilions dead, pavings dead. Oh my god. It's working its way towards me. So she's Peach. next, pretty much. Dead. Pebble, dead, pelican, dead. We Those things, they aren't done yet. And even if they do chess oh, I feel like they'll be one at behind my door. And all I've got to do is punch in 30 more numbers into this keypad and then we're gone. What's this guy's I've deal? This. What's his deal? I feel like he's hiding Maybe something. I'm getting you out of here. Lindy, come here, do the it's a bit hard when that thing's just attacking her. How's she meant to do the numbers? It's that Amy's Coombs! It, well. He, he was born Richard Coombs, because I know everything about him. He changed his name to Ricky September when he reached 50,000 followers, but ch ch check your files, he was born Coombs. See, he comes before me! She's just thrown him under the bus. Lindy. Tardis. Here they are. It seems odd seeing them in these outfits. It seems almost fan made. Me too. Is this strange? So, uh, I don't know, something's like going on say. here. Thank you. Or you could come with us. We could what? Come with us? <laughs> yeah, we helped you escape, didn't we? So we could get you out of here in the blink of an eye. <laughs> I, I have a ship. It's called the TARDIS that... We couldn't travel with you. What? what why not? Because you, sir, are not one of us. I mean... So, you were kind, although it was your duty to save me, obviously. I mean, screen to screen contact is just about acceptable, but in person, that's impossible. <laughs> like, what's you have about? a magic box, seriously. Bigger on the inside. <laughs> Excuse me, sir, <laughs> that's voodoo. And it doesn't matter where we end up living, because it is our God given duty to maintain the standards of fine time forever. Now, thank you. And goodbye. If you just allow me to save your lives. Well, bunch of racists. Turn away, ladies, before you contaminate it. Make you all die! Leave them to die. I and would. I can save your lives! Nah, they don't even deserve it. <laughs> wow. What a performance. 
performance. Is that it? Okay guys, that was uh, Dot and Bubble and... Wow, what a different episode. Um, I don't really know what to think of it. It's, um, I liked it. I liked the ending. It was different. The Doctor hasn't really won. So it's quite an odd episode because of that. And I like those episodes. I like episodes where the Doctor doesn't win. You know, Logopolis, Case of Androzani, um, you know, there's a there's bunch of them really in there, but um, episodes where the Doctor doesn't w win are some of my favourites. And the Doctor's not won this time because he's rescued a bunch of racists. That's mad. Now, did slightly see a bit of a rumour that there's going to be a, a bit of an ending like this but then um, didn't really sort of regard it or anything I sort of just you know school well past it but um, no I, I, I quite like it I can I don't really know how this ending's going to be taken or the episode as a whole is going to be taken on the internet and stuff like that but personally I, I, I'm a fan I'm a fan. I like it. I also kind of like the fact that we don't really know what the hell has happened. We don't know about these slugs. We don't know anything. You know, we've left with more cool questions than answers. Um, but from, you know, what I've been able to gather, the Doctor and Ruby have been... So gathering these um, uh, these sur uh, survivors um, who are obviously lower down the alphabet, um, and so keeping them in a refugee camp before they sail off, uh, but, but they will die because these sort of lugs will still come for them. But um, oh yeah, because we've gone back to the home world haven't they or something aren't they um, I think I think that's where they're going I think I did miss where they were going at the end um, but um, yeah they chose not to go with the doctor because of his skin colour pretty much I'm thinking that his TARDIS is a bit of voodoo and stuff like that it's mad it's mad, it's like, yeah, um, I I am excited to give this episode a bit of a rewatch, to be honest, but, um, no, I'm I'm a bit of a fan, uh, I'm going to have a quick scroll on Twitter, see what people think, um, also can I just say, that is the worst uh, fake moustache that I've ever seen, shoot his moustache, I mean you can tell that it was uh, um, yeah you can tell that it, it was still filmed, that this one was filmed when he was doing sex education um, or Barbie so I'm just scrolling on Twitter and um, to be honest the, the views on it are quite negative Oh, that surprises me. I'm, I'm, I, I, I'm guessing I might not have understood this ending like everyone else is. Um, so f obviously that leak has turned out to be true, true, woo. Um, but a lot of people. I don't know. It seems to be quite mixed. I've seen someone here say that that was the episode. Wow, and all stuff like that. Um, I'm quite surprised at that. Yeah, um, I mean, Shooty was just phenomenal, just absolutely amazing. Um, and, um, 
Oh yeah, I've seen, yeah, there's a couple of people here saying they really like the episode. I have to say this episode is an interesting concept and I really like it. It's taking a different turn on Doctor Who and I really think it's good to take these turns. Yeah, that's why I was saying how obviously taking a turn and showing off that uh, the Doctor doesn't always win. Um, yeah, quite quite mixed uh, mixed reactions but the um, majority seem to be pretty good from what I can tell but yeah it's going to be um, it's going to be exciting to see um, I'm excited to watch on on Reese and hear RTD's thoughts behind the episode and stuff um, so that should be in true Western. And next week's looks good. Uh, rogue. I just hope. Um, I just hope it's good. <laughs> but um, yeah, uh, that's it. Um, that's all for Doctor Who this week. Quite a bit of a dark, depressing episode where we sort of leave with more cool questions than answers. But a bit like last week, I'm excited to hear what you guys think. So. Do let me know your thoughts. Uh, but that is all for this time. Thank you so much for watching. If you have enjoyed this video, please leave a like and a comment. Uh, tell me what you thought of the episode and follow me on Twitter at DanW. A favourite link is in the description. Now I'll see you next week for Rogue Regency time. Um, yeah, so see you, see you then. Goodbye.